Hey, Village Meadows, uh, coming to you again this week. You know, we, we tell you this, but it's the truth. There's always so many things going on, and we have to choose, you know, what to give you the update for. So this week, we're going we're gonna to tell you about five things uh, that's coming up just in the next week or so, just out of that, because some of them are a little bit bigger, and we want to let you know about it. On the, on the 20th, this coming Saturday, is our Walk for Life. You've heard us talking about it, our support for CareNet. Uh, meet at Calvary Church at 8 a.m., uh, to support that, or maybe you've already been approached by some of the youth. You know, they're trying to uh, raise funds to donate to that, and they've got the whole thing going on. Uh, be praying for it, at the, uh, you know, if, if you're not able to show up and be there with us or come out and support it also. And then Sunday, the 21st, is the makeup training date for Vacation Bible School. That's going to be during the small group hour, so the 930 to 1030 slot. And we had said that it was in third space, but actually that was a misspeak. It's in the Family Life Center. So this Sunday, between uh, the two services in the small group hour, the VBS makeup in the family life center. So if you didn't make the first one, uh, please come to that one. If you did come to the first one, you don't have to come to this one. This was just the makeup date. Uh, also that evening uh, on the 21st, this Sunday is the alive youth dessert auction. You've heard us talking about it's a fundraiser for camp, trying to help offset the cost of camp. It's at, uh, starting at five 15. Uh, if you're bringing your desserts, you know, if you are contributing desserts, you need to have them there. The, uh, the auction itself starts at six o'clock. And if you're coming, you're planning on you know bidding on it, that kind of thing. Don't forget money. Uh, that's kind of important too, because that, that you know that's raising money for the for the uh, youth. Now then, fast forward a little bit more. On the 27th, on Saturday, is this month's nachos and brichatos, our men's event. It's going to be on Saturday this month for two reasons. One, we are smoking brisket for the 28th, the one year anniversary. So guys, come out. We're going to start about nine o'clock. It's an all day thing. I mean, you don't have to stay all day. Come and go as, as you can that day. Hang out. We're going to have cornhole set up. Just a time of fellowship. But we're also going to be smoking meat and, you know, just spending time together hanging out. We'll probably eat something, on, you know, around lunch like you do. Those kind of things. And then the next day, the 28th, that's our one-year anniversary of being in the new worship center. Believe it or not, it's already here. We've been talking about it. But just a reminder, no 8 a.m. service. We do have small groups like normal at 930. And then one combined family service at 11 a.m., where everyone's going to come together. There's no child care because we just all want to be together to celebrate what God's been doing. And then right after that, we're having a good old-fashioned potluck in the Family Life Center where we're just going to enjoy each other's company, uh, have a meal together, fellowship, and again, just kind of celebrate. And then a couple of days later, on the 30th, our young adult uh, group that meets on Tuesdays and some other times too, they are having a, an art and cider event. They're going to eat food. They're going to drink cider. They're going to make artist-type things, they're calling it. Um, that's going to be from 6.30 till 9-ish, and the exact locations to be determined. We'll announce that probably in a week uh, to let you know exactly where it's going to be, but it's just a good time to come out that Tuesday evening and hang out together. That's enough for now because we have more we could tell you about. See you Sunday. Love you guys.